Hey y'all, Pam here with Be Creative Crafts and welcome back. So today's episode of What's in the Box Wednesday is actually going to be a What's in the Bag. Y'all, I went to one of my local Dollar Trees that I don't normally go to and they had some amazing new finds. So let me show you what I found so you can be on the lookout for them at your store too. All right, somebody asked me what this was the other day. It is a Dr. Pepper can rose. Alrighty, y'all. Let's head over to the craft table and let me show you what I picked up at Dollar Tree. Alright, y'all. Are y'all ready to see what was new at my local Dollar Tree? Alright, so let me pull this back down here. This is a new sign. Um, I have seen it online, but I have not seen it in my store. But it says, Be you. Be happy, be kind, and it is one of their um, hanging signs. Of course, you know it's smooth, and these are um, these are raised. The bees are raised. But I thought that was really, really cute. So again, be kind, be happy, be you. And I'm gonna stick this back over here up in the window seal. Okay, another thing that I saw at the store today. Um, now, I did go to two different stores. Uh, one of the stores I do not go to very often. Um, and I had not seen several of the items that they had at that store at the ones that I normally go to. Now, this one is that one of the ones that I usually go to, but I had not seen these before. This is a hardback little, con little case here. And what's inside here are sticky notes. So they've got the flag style, the solid, some round, and then some smaller ones. But I thought this was a really cute package deal here and I liked it so I picked it up because I'm always needing a sticky note for something. So I did pick those up. Okay now y'all this I picked up yesterday at the store that I do not normally go to and y'all I have not seen it at either of my local stores that I normally frequent and I was at one of those today and they did not have this. So be sure to check your store in case they do. But y'all, it is fusible interfacing. And this is 20 inches by one yard or 5.8 centimeters by 0.91 meters. And like I said, I have not seen this in store before. It is by Crafter Square. And so... I thought it seemed like a pretty good deal for a dollar and a quarter. I thought that was a really good uh, price on that. So, yeah. So, be sure to check out your local store and see if they have that. Let's see. What else? Again, um, correction tape. I did pick up some of the stuff in the office supply section. Um, this is the first time I've seen correction tape there. I have seen the, um, the liquid. I prefer the tape. Personal preference, y'all can use what you want to use, but it's the first time I had seen it in store. So let me show you what else did I get here. Oh, okay, also by Crafter Square, they had these resealable bags, which are the uh, craft size Ziploc bags, which are great for packaging stuff to send out, but you do get 20 for a dollar and a quarter. Again, I thought that was a pretty good deal. So I picked some of those up. Okay, now these pens, I'm all about the color, so I really don't think these were new. I just picked them up because I liked them. Same thing with these magnetic pens. So again, these are not new, but I did pick up a couple while I was at the store today. Okay, now this tin I had not seen before, and I couldn't find any, a display of them anywhere. There was one lonely bucket sitting amongst all of the Halloween stuff, so I had to pick it up. It just says Simply Blessed, and it is one of their uh, round tin pots, and so I had to pick it up because I just really liked it. So we're going to set that back over there. Again, this is not something that's new, but I did go ahead and pick up another one of their adhesive cutting mats because I'm always use, needing um, an extra cutting mat, whether I'm, I have one in one room and I'm in the other room. But this way I have an extra one to leave um, in here. So we're going to stick that over there. Another thing to be on the lookout for is they are getting in their fall fabric. Um, so I did go ahead and pick one of these up. These are, a, this is a fat quarter, so it's 18 inch by 21 inch, 100% cotton. 
Again, this is not new to the store, but they do rotate out the colors. So just be on the lookout if you're looking for it. And I did also see they have already got some of their Christmas fabric out. So just be on the lookout the next time you're in your store if you're looking for fabric. All right, y'all. So this is the first time. Let me move some of this stuff out of the way. Give me just a second here. Because I want y'all to be able to see this next item because... Holy smokes, super duper cute. And again, I have not seen these in store. And y'all, that is an amigurumi kit. And look at the little, y'all, I'm sorry for the little, I'm trying to get the glare off of, there we go. But look at that little rabbit, how cute. Okay, so what do you get? You get the plastic needle, yarn, stuffing, crochet hook, plastic beads, that would be for his little eyes, and an instruction sheet. How adorable is that? Now, y'all know I am not a big amigurumi fan, but I did go ahead and pick up a kit because I wanted to show y'all. Now, I do not know if this will be enough yarn to complete the project, and I probably will not make it using the hook that they have uh, sent with this kit if I do decide to make it. But I did want to pick one up to show y'all so that you can be on the lookout. Now, again, like I said, this was the first time I had seen this in store, and this was at the location that I was at yesterday that I do not normally go to. So, I ran out at lunch today to one of the locations that I do frequent, and y'all, they also had these in, and they, store yesterday only had this one left. So, today, let me show you what I found. They have a dinosaur, and again, it comes with everything that you need to complete the project, and they also had a cute little puppy. How cute are they? So, again, I don't know that I will be making these. These may end up in a giveaway because I am not a big fan of doing the amigurumi. But I did want to pick these up to show y'all so that you can be on the lookout for them at your local stores. They also have out their Halloween items. And y'all know how I am with my trucks. It doesn't matter if it's an old red truck, blue truck, green truck, orange truck, or in this case, black truck. So, I had to pick it up because I thought it was really cute. And y'all, my camera is super close, but that's just better for y'all to see the details, right? Okay, what else is in this little bag? Oh, again, not new, but hello. I mean, y'all know I had to pick that up. Orange and white check, hello. Go big orange, you know I had to pick that up. Again, this is something that is not new, but I had to pick it up because it is the iridescentiness of it. And look at that fabulousness. And this, y'all, is actually an iron-on sheet. Check it out. And let's see what it's saying here. Cut shapes, position in place to adhere. Cover with thin cloth. Press for 30 to 40 seconds. Spot clean as needed. But I picked it up because of the pretty, shiny, chrome, iridescent -y, glossy beautifulness. Okay, now, I have seen the large felt rolls that are sold with the fat quarters, but now they have got this here, and this may not be new. It's just the first time that I have seen it, and they also had another package with different colors, um, but I did go ahead and pick this up, and you actually get five rolls of the felt, again, for a dollar and a quarter, so not a bad deal at all. All right, y'all. Now, this I only saw, again, at the location that I do not normally go to. I did not see it at my store that I frequent. So, this is also another one of those items that right now is only available in select stores. And, y'all, that is a diamond painting kit. What? Yes. Okay, so this is not an all over. This is just a partial coverage. And what that means is only part of the image um, is created using the diamond drills. But look at that. Isn't he cute? They did have several different uh, designs. I just went with the two can. And what do you get in this package? You get, trying to get the glare off, you get the diamond painting sheet, a sorting tray, rhinestones, silicone clay, diamond painting pen and an instruction sheet so you get all of your little drills a little sorting tray the pen and a little thing of the glue that you use to pick up the little drills but how cute is he so 
we'll give this a go and see what it looks like. And y'all, I think that is everything that I picked up that was new. So, I hope y'all saw something new that you might want to check and be on the lookout for at your local stores. So, I hope y'all have a fantastic day. Remember, be creative. And until next time, happy crafting!